Following the tragic loss of Hibbing native and former Bulldog Adam Johnson last week in the hockey world continues to grieve and hold important conversations about the use of neck protection from youth to collegiate to professional leagues all over the world. The discussion about possible rule changes for protective gear has been brought to the forefront. No changes have been made for the NCAA, but UMD players did have the option to have neck protection ordered for them. Earlier today, Bulldog head coach Scott Sandlin brought up how the topic of neck guards was a conversation last year for the NCAA committee. He added again how unfortunate it is that it takes such a catastrophic event to take place in order for a necessary change to be made. UMD captain and grad student Luke Lohai also advocated for the use of extra protection. That's a freak accident. It doesn't happen very much, but you never know. Can't be too careful. And also, I just think it's something that you want to pass down to younger gener generations too, right? You want to be careful, want to make sure that kids are taking care of their bodies, making sure that they're safe out there too. So I think it would be important for us to make a statement. Some other coaches that I've talked to that offered that to their teams, like all other guys make those decisions, right? So I'm not shocked by that. Um, got some stuff that Kyle Garnsey ordered. So if guys want to wear that, I'm all for it. We'll have more on the Bulldogs' big home-and-home -home series against the Gophers tomorrow night at 6. The women are having conversations surrounding how they, too, will make changes regarding greater protection in practices and in games. Both teams discussing how unfortunate it is that bad things have to happen to raise awareness. Women's head coach Maura Kroll told her team that she is also willing to do whatever it is to grant players with further protection. In fact, she is already seeing a big chunk of her players requesting neck guards. Adding that with this being a rule changing year in the NCAA, there's no reason that they should not be intensely looking at this too. I would be shocked if it didn't. I don't understand the uh, argument against. They're uncomfortable. They don't look cool. Uh, nothing that really is, is you know, gonna dissuade uh, smart people from making good decisions for the health of student athletes and athletes in general. It's definitely shed light onto a few areas that I never have thought about too much previously, but it's a discussion for sure. Uh, coach gave us the opportunity to wear neck protection if we choose to, so um, it's an individual decision whether you want to or not. UMD will have a moment of silence ahead of their game this weekend and will have stickers displayed on their helmets as well. The Bulldogs drop the puck with the Tommies on Friday at 6. And